r slash ask reddit people that wake up at around 4 or 5 am why the same it's the only part of the day that's peaceful for me plus i don't want to rush in the morning nothing makes the day suck more than waking up late because i have to be at work at 730 and i want to get a workout in before i start my day starting my day with a workout always makes me feel like i've started my day off on the right foot and i'm not nearly as stressed when i've gotten out some of that anxious energy this personally it's much harder to push myself to work out after working for like 10 hours so i wake up at 5 go exercise from 5 20 to 6 and leave by 6 40. it lets work be part of my day instead of the reason why i wake up gives me about two hours of alone time in the morning i've never heard it put that way i like it never thought of it this way and i wake up at 5 to 5 32. my reason to helps ward off the depression because my toddler wakes up at 5 a.m. Yup. Used to sleep in. Kids are teenagers now but I still wake up early. Different reason though. Waking up early was the only way I could get kid free time. Still works. Cats. Work. One of mine has discovered that she can lie on her back and use her claws to ratchet herself to and fro under my upholstered platform bed frame. Sometimes she just claws herself all the way around the perimeter. It makes a racket and shakes the bed. 5 a.m. is her favorite time to do this. My job is an hour away and I still need about an hour to cry in the shower. Because the psycho above me does, puts on her wooden shoes and decides to open and close every dresser drawer she has 20 times each minute for the next 3 hours. Noise machine and earplugs only help slightly. Sigh. Dang. Wooden shoes huh? No idea, but that's when I wake up, and I can't sleep anymore. I end up starting the day with a few good hours of video games and chain smoking one hitters. And GT, chain smoking one hitters. I do that shit too. Nah, it's too early to smoke a whole J proceeds to smoke an equivalent amount one batty rip at a time. Oh man. I hate envy you. This was me in college for all four years. My body doesn't let me wake up later than that no matter what. Ditto. I started getting up this early for work, but now, alarm or not. I'm up between 4 and amp, 5 am. If I try to sleep in, which I used to be a master of, I feel like complete garbage the rest of the day. Work. I just do. It's rare for me to wake up because of my alarm clock which is set for 6 am. Why? I don't know, but in the spring, I enjoy going out to my deck at 5 am and listening to the birds chirping while I drink my tea. Same. I wake up at 4 every morning automatically. At this point my 6.30 alarm tells me that it's time to get ready for work rather than time to wake me up. I used to be able to sleep in until 11 or so. Now I'm lucky if I can sleep past 6. Sometimes I get a few mornings in a row where I wake up before 5 and there isn't much I can do, I am now over 40, maybe that's the reason. Taking a huge. I had a boss who had the most regular shit schedule. Unfortunately it was at work. Every morning he would come in at 9 o'clock and go to the shitter at 9.15 clockwork i was amazed his bowels functioned like that because i go to bed at 8 someone invited me to something starting at 6 30 pm on a school night i realized i wouldn't be able to get to sleep till midnight if i said yes no thank you i like my 8 30 bedtime my body is on a weird sleep cycle right now where it doesn't like sleeping more than four to five hours so i'm going to bed at midnight ish sleeping until four or five and then taking a nap later lol i hate the morning I'm a morning person and I like the quiet time before my wife wakes up. Plus on work days I don't feel rushed and can enjoy a cup of coffee, or read a bit or whatever. Every sunrise is a gift. Wife does this, I don't. She spends the time working out, mostly, and just gets to enjoy some nice quiet time. It's pretty much just a trade off with going to bed early, but right before bed isn't really the best time to work out, so she does it this way. I try to see at least one every day. Coffee, workout, quiet time, sunrise, hunting slash fishing. I don't even use an alarm. They're probably trying to sneak in a few hours of peace before their pets realize it's technically morning and start demanding breakfast. Start 6 leave 3. More evening time. This is my reason as well. I love the world without people in it. Why I prefer the night? P. Drink my coffee lazily. I used to work 6am to 2pm and honestly it was the best shift I've ever worked. 
ID get off at 2 and everything was still open even doctors offices, mechanics, banks, the DMV, etc. And I had so many more hours of daylight even in the winter. ID get up at 5 a.m. each morning and go to bed at 10 p.m. each night. I miss those days so bad. I'd rather work out before bed. I wish I could physically get myself up earlier rather than get to bed later. I envy people who do this. Because I used to work at Whole Foods. My shift time was 4 a.m. to 12 p.m. I quit that job 8 years ago and it still has me fucked up. Work work, zug zug. It's the time of the day I am the happiest. Anxiety. I have a severe case of anxiety and depression. I wake up to go to the bathroom and my brain will not let me go back to bed. It triggers my nerves and intrusive thoughts come flooding in. I have never wanted to kill myself more than I do when this happens, and it did this morning, and also it occurred yesterday. It's torture. I hate it. One of the days, I might give in just to shut my brain up. Not really, but holy fuck, it's brutal as balls. This was much too far down to this. I used to wake up at 4 a.m. so I could make my ex, then gf, breakfast and walk our dog before driving an hour to work. Now I wake up at 4 a.m. so I can get two hours in the gym before first formation. It's very motivational to be up early and work harder, it's just hard to start doing. So my brain and central nervous system can have some peace before my toddler wakes up. It's the most peaceful part of the day. I enjoy having my morning coffee while the world is silent, no cars, no barking dogs, no airplanes, no cacophony of an army of two stroke garden equipment, devoid of the playful slash annoying screams of the neighborhood sex trophies making their way to school, hell even the birds are pretty quiet at 5 am. No matter how fucked the rest of the day gets, it's a damn nice start. Day trading. Work. I gotta pee. Then it's either back to bed or get ready for work. Sometimes I just wake up then and going back to sleep ain't happening. I work as a lifeguard at a fitness center that opens at 4.30 am. We have people who literally camp outside at 4.29 waiting for the building to open so they can work out slash swim. I asked one of the early morning regulars once I know why I'm here, but why are you here and she goes I have a husband and three boys. This is my only piece of sanity I have left and went on to swim 45 laps. So that's why I guess. My wife has night terrors. They end my sleep. My body loves to wake me up at 6 o'clock. And it used to not be like that. I used to sleep until sometimes 2 p.m. on the weekends. But as I started working on my health and making dietary changes and healing my gut and getting fresh sunlight, things just kind of reset. In the summer that's just when I wake up, regardless of when I went to bed. And I don't feel like I didn't get enough sleep. Powered by the sun I guess. I'm lucky to have a really flexible job in terms of hours. I can start at 6 a.m. if I want, as long as I put in 8 hours. As I get older I notice my bowel movements are a little more constant. Every morning at 4 I have to pee and every morning around 5 I need to poop. Only problem is I don't wake up until 7. Same. My bladder can't sleep later than 430. When I'm up, unfortunately I'm up. I'm a morning person, I like to watch the day come alive, I love the peacefulness of my home and the world that time of the morning, I like to run and work out before I start the rest of my day. Hello everyone. Thanks for sticking to the end of this video. I really appreciate it. I just wanted to humbly ask you to subscribe to the channel. According to my statistics, 100% of my viewers in the past 28 days are not subscribed. I have always wanted this channel to reach 1000 subscribers, and if you want to support and be a part of that, subscribe. It's free and it's an awesome way to support the channel. Thanks again. Reddit glitch out.